tell us about what changes you've made and what programs you've implemented since you've been executive director uh, of the Institute. The primary focus now is on the kind of research that can be useful to the communities. Um, we have done a lot of research that helps community-based organizations. So for example, uh, when we talk about poverty in the senior community in, of uh, Asian Americans, this helps the Asian senior serving community-based organizations to access data that they need to support their grants and the other kinds of things that they do to get funding. It also helps them identify where their resources need to go and the kinds of programs that have to be designed. Uh, and so that is a primary focus versus a purely academic focus. I, I'm trying to make the uh, research a lot more accessible and usable by the community itself. And then I would say the other focus has been on ensuring a more robust Asian American Studies program within the City University of New York. There have been programs in, in the university on its various campuses. We have 25 campuses in the university system. But it is not as robust as we would like to see it. Uh, this is an opportune time uh, to really push for the enhancement of these programs because in New York City, uh, the Asian community is now nearly 15 percent and is growing again and again. Um, in addition to that, CUNY has an amazing number of Asian American students. Overall, on the 24 campuses, uh, we represent over 20 percent of the students. On certain campuses, our numbers are even larger. For example, at Baruch College, which is a, um, very well known for its business programs, 40 percent of the student population is Asian. At Hunter College, again another one of our flagship campuses, the population is over a third. So you can see that we're represented in numbers. Uh, we need to make sure that the curriculum meets their needs, helps them to understand the place of Asian Americans within um, the context of New York City and the nation. And we need to simply make sure that other communities are aware of our issues. You can't prepare students to uh, enter the workforce in New York City or anywhere in the world without some understanding of Asian culture, Asian history, Asian American issues. So how are you making progress on some of these programs? I think that uh, we are making some progress in terms of there's more focus on this. Uh, more recently, scholars at CUNY have begin, began to create uh, some more organizations, conferences, and um, get more information out there about the Asian American community. Community-based organizations have started to collaborate with academia in order to make sure that these issues are front and center.